go. First ice 2021-2022 season. As you can tell, there's a couple other people already out here, but no harm, no foul. Only had to drive an hour and a half to get here. Looks like about four and a half inches. Awesome. Gosh, it's beautiful out. Here's the gear set up. First outing of the year. Got it all in one sled this year. Last year I had three. <laughs> Here we go. I think we're marking something. Let's see if this is gonna be the first spot we're gonna set up for the day. There it is, hooked up. First fish of the ice season. Just a little sunny. Just a little guy. There she is, number one. All right, time. let's set up here and we'll jig some bigger ones in maybe. How's it going everybody? This is First Ice 2021, 2022 for me, November 27th, the day after Black Friday, 2021. I'm out here going for some panfish today. So let's see what we get into. I know that there's fish down here. I can see them in the live scope screen. I'll pop that up so you can see it. Set up on a nice spot here. Still getting used to this again from open water season, but let's do this. Yes. Here we go. Let's drop her down. Let's catch another fish. That's a nice size gill. Here, buddy. That's a nice size gill. Nice. Probably good six or seven inches. Down she goes. We've got a gold Google Eye jig on there with a waxy. This is the size two Google Eye jig. You can see them come up to me like this. Look at this. Boom. Wait for it. Smashed. Look at that. Oh, fun. What is, something's jamming up on me here. Oh, I've got a nest in my reel. Gonna have to hand line this one. Oh, just a little guy. Look at this. Ain't the start of a season unless you got a little nest going already. Jeez. Here he comes. There it is, there it is. It's a better one. Better looking guy. Got the waxy. It's a better looking fish, huh? Still pretty small though. Still pretty small. There we go. That one feels like probably the best of the day. Yes, it is. That's a bluegill. Nice. That's what we're looking for. Right there. There it is. Biggest bluegill of the day so far. Just gonna measure on her. Seven and three quarter. Nice fish. Letting her go to see another day. Oh, is this a pike? This has gotta be a pike. Super cool with the pike. Another good size gill. For first ice, right? These aren't giants. All right, hat backwards. Let's see what we can do. Hooked up. I just had to turn the hat backwards. Nice size gill. Ooh. That would be an eater. This is probably eight, eight and a half. A fat eight. Beautiful fish though. Wowzers. <laughs> Look at that. First perch of the season right here. Check that out. First perch, 2021, 2022 ice season. Look at that little tyke. Woo! I should 
should make this the thumbnail photo. There it is. That's a better size gill. Splash me, buddy. Better size one. Nice, oh, probably eight incher. Good deal, good deal. Here it is, for the first time out on the ice, Flame King 10,000 BTU feeder. Throw her up there. We're gonna throw her on right in the middle. We're gonna see how it does. I do have a camera up here, so we're gonna see how that fares. Hopefully it doesn't overheat, turn off, but ooh, I can feel the heat already from it. She's heating up. Ceramic pad is turning red. Maybe I'll go as low as it can. There we go, we got it on minimum. And if not, it's probably because it's sitting right on the ice. We'll put it on a mat and see if it turns itself off then. All right, I just put it on a mat. It was getting warm in here. I don't think it was turning off, so it's just on one of them little foam squares. We'll see if that does the trick. This is what we're using, the gold Google Eye jig from Acme. The panfish are just slaying this little guy. They absolutely love it. I had to manually turn the heater off because uh, my cameras have got my big camera there and a camera up top. They are getting warm, getting a high temperature thing. So I've got a, probably not in this shack, this isn't gonna work too well with that guy because the floor is still uh, pretty cool. I don't. I also don't have it banked in, so that's gonna be a challenge. Next weekend, I should have the Black Hole Outdoor Shack out, which has an insulated floor. We'll test it then as well. It's got a pike chilling right underneath me. And I got a little micro Z-Viber and a shiner and it doesn't want either of them. Huh. So with this being the first day for me out on the ice with the 10,000 BTU Flame King, it's not bad. My shack's a little small for this and I've got a camera up high that keeps overheating. So um, today is in a really great test for it in terms of the thermostat. I do have it on a mat over in the corner that you can kind of see that should help with it. But the ceiling gets so warm before um, it can turn itself off. The one thing that I do want to point out though that I absolutely do not care for that I think we've been spoiled on with the buddy heaters is this thing's empty right now. And I, normally you can bend it out and turn it, but you gotta turn this right in place and there is not much clearance on the bottom here to try to wiggle this thing out of here. It's kind of a, like, it doesn't go because the regulator is fixed. It's kind of a pain in the ass. Not the end of the world, but not ideal. Just get like a side grip on it because my fingers can't even fit behind it. So I can show you what I'm talking about. This guy is fixed. It doesn't turn or tilt. I'll put a picture in here of what the buddy heater has, even the portable buddy that's comparable to this. And you can see how that turns, makes it way easier to get out. All right, crack and open the Monster Energy drink. It's about 4.30 p.m. Let's do this. Dropping down a micro Z-Viber with a waxy tipped on it. Uh, it's perch pattern on my jigging rod. I've got a shiner minnow on a dead stick treble hook. Best of the day so far, eight and a half inches. It panned out, staying a little bit later. Beautiful fish. See you later. Caught that bluegill on this guy right here. It is a Z-Viber micro perch pattern with a single hook on the back. Uh, tipped it with a waxy. This thing is great. Between this and the Google-Eyed Gold Size 2 Jig from Acme Tackle, that's what's been doing the trick today. I'll link both of them below. Got another one. She was sitting on the bottom. Oh, first crop dog of the day. You gotta love it. She was sitting and waiting. It's that time of day. Another one on that Z-Viber, eight and a half inch crappie. First one of the year for me. Uh, it's been a nice multi-species day. Well, the bite just slowed down for me for quite a while now. So that's a wrap for me on first ice of the season. I'm looking forward to doing a ton more videos. Thank you all for watching and until next time, take it easy.